it'll be two spots for David, seven spots for Big Truck here in group break number two. Let's take a look. Let's do so, it. Just see, you know, gotta do the randoms. Not gonna be the same. David exact P spots. with two. Big truck with the rest. Yes, David P with two. Big truck with the rest. Let's do the randoms. Let's do the random. What were the ace specs on a box number two? Um, we got a dupe, and then we got the secret box. Okay. Five times. I want to see the energy. Did we get a dragapult? We did not. Mm, need the dragapult. No dragapult. Two, three, four, and five. I don't need the IP. Okay. Ah. All right, all right, all right, all right. Five times again. Five. Let's see how this lands. David P.S. Fighting in Grass. Joshua, Joshua K., our good friend, Big Truck. As the Metal Dragon spot, Psychic Fire Trainer, Water, Darkness, Color, the spot, and Lightning. Oh, that's fun. What? We literally have the same initials. Oh, yeah. Big truck. Yeah. I, yeah, didn't even put that together. David got grass again. That's funny. Uh, let's do that, that, that. 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 Boom. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, Greninja Chance. All right. My first rip here. I did do the box for our, our YouTube. If you guys go check out our YouTube page, me and my good friend Joe Steet are opening up a box on there. We got some cool stuff out of that box. Go check that out. Uh, fighting ground? fighting Ground types are fighting types in the TCG. Yeah, ground, fighting, and rock are all the ground same. Fighting rock. Phoebus. Let's see the Vulpix. Adorable. Iron Bundle. We have Applin. Applin Reverse. Oh, the nice Walking Wake Reverse. Again, those are so cool. And we have a Heatran as our rare. Lunch was crazy today. I had a bunch of Wendy's nuggets. Our rare is Chandelure. Since during your turn, you have each player draw a card. For Pokemon, that seems kind of bad. Uh, how many sauces did I use? I think I used like four of the barbecue sauce packets. They Pretty literally sure. gave us so Dude, many. They gave us so many. They gave us so many. Like, did they give us each ten? Sauces? There was ten in my bag. Ten sauces? Ten barbecue sauces in my, my bag. God. I don't know if they have any in season. Maybe no. they just gave us all the sauces. But they gave me all the sauces, but... Well, they put all the sauces in one Rupon. bag. Just, oh, they did? Okay. Yeah, and they gave us ten. And a teal mask ogre pond. They gave I just us more than that because I grabbed like two. Okay. And I was eating mine. <laughs> so they gave us like 12. That's what we just did. We got the bucket. I asked about the bucket. There was like, they said, we don't have the bucket, but we can do five, ten pieces. So that's how that worked out. Whatever. Lucky helmet, cool fable. The, point, the reason we got it was to get the bucket. So this is one of the cards I saw in like the most playable cards. So I want to read it real quick. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon has any uh, dark energy attached, remove three damage counters from one of your Pokemon to one of your opponents, huh? That's interesting. So if you attach a dark to it, you can just that's remove damage wild. counters from your from your Pokemon to your opponents. That's crazy. That, that's kind of nonsense. We did not each get a bucket. We split a bucket. Was yeah, we split like, a bucket I, between I, me, T, and uh, Stavi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The bucket between oh, three people did. wasn't that bad. Well, Dean, just like I finished my my meal off with thirteen more McDonald's cookies, right? Yes. Yeah. That's all right. All right. Yep. Anthony confirmed had the bucket and then his thirteen <laughs> McDonald's cookies in yep. one sitting. Yep. 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 All right. I hope we get the Probo Pass for it. Search your deck for a Pokemon the same name as one of your opponent's Pokemon and play Reveal it. That's an interesting card. I can't see ever really running that, but Snorlax, Sandshrew, and Hisuian Arcanine. If your bench Pokemon have any damage counters on them, so attack does 90. Does 120 potentially for free? That's really interesting, actually. It's the cool. Macargo EX, if we pull it, you should take you should read it. Okay. 
And two large cards. It's a course. fire draw engine card, and it's fun. Me who drinks no soda at all. <laughs> and two cards. For sure. Skullipede. Oh, we got the Frostlass. Let's go! That's the creepy awesome. Frostlass. Oh, it's awesome, though. It's, like, creepy in an awesome way. During your Pokemon check, I put one damage counter on each Pokemon that has an ability. Both yours and any new opponents, except for Frostlass. The creepy Frostlass. Sick. Awesome card. Water, I assume this is truck. It is. And Alex and Hannah's are hollow. The creepy Frostlass. I love it. This cool fairy is adorable. Just walking downtown. So small. It looks almost like a Cleffa. Yeah. It th that's what I thought, too. Oh, we got a burst. A spec. We have Unfair Stamp. I think that's one that's of the better ones. Use this card only if any of your Pokemon were knocked out during your front's last turn. Each player shuffles their hand. Ah, so it's like a Myono. That's really good. That's cool. Nice art, too. I like the aspects a lot. We have a Palafin. It's a pretty Palafin. That's, that's, that's a giant... That's a Yu-Gi-Oh! text box. What is it? Yeah, oh, that... Text boxes. During massive. your turn, when this Pokemon moves from the active spot to the bench, you may search your deck for a Palafin EX and switch it with this Pokemon. Any attached cards. It's a magic. Remain on the new Pokemon. Switch from this card in your deck. That's really interesting. That's a magic text box. That's a Yu Gi Oh text box. Ability. This is a dolphin. Oh, yes. yeah. Me and Yukobi we were talking about how much we love playing against mono blue players. Are you mono blue? Oh, always. I've been known to be. First deck I ever seriously played was Mono Blue. Gross. Uh, we have Aridos, Alakazam Reverse, and we got the Luxray EX. That's because you love playing against I love that this is just a Thought Seed. He has no soul. I love Ability, th this is a Dolphin. I love that this is just a Thought Seed. Like, for, that does 120 damage <laughs> for a double colorless. Did you, your bone reveals her hand, discard a card you find there. What do you want me to say? Yeah, it's, no, just, that's, that's a Thought Seed. Seed. That is a rare. The Alakazam? Yeah. <clears throat> this is a dolphin. All right. We have an Emolga, Glamora, and we have the Teal Mask Ogre Pond. You may touch a basic grass and use your card to your Pokemon in possession. Your... Touch grass? Really good. Touch grass? Touch grass. Is that what I heard? Touch grass? Yes. That's really, actually, this card's really good. That's a really, really good. This is a good card. Once per turn, you might touch a basic grass energy card from your hand to this Pokemon. If you attach it this way, draw a card. That's crazy. That's not bad. Accelerates out the attack. It's a base EX. That's that's probably going to see some play. That's really good. Seems really good. I guess we're playing the game again. I'll cool. probably learn it. Of course, with, with, um, with Modern Horizons 3 right around the corner, probably uh, we'll play a Pokemon for a week or two and then just right back. Across one of my favorite Pokemon. Yeah, Mountain Top Horizons 3 right around the corner, and then right after that is, is going to be the Assassin's Creed set, which I will be buying plenty of. Uh, I'll be sharing my rips for <laughs> sure because I'm definitely going to be chasing after it's, it's the. No, I'm going to want. I want one of the Look Italian. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, <laughs> I want one of the numbered Italian Da Vinci's. Ah. And one of the Greek numbered. Cleopatra. So you're going to be ripping collectees. Yes, I'm going to be spending money. Agron and Chandelure. Yes. I'll buy a bundle of Modern Horizons 3 and then some singles. I got to get some Vinci's because there's still a couple I should be buying by the time I'm done. Okay. okay. How's it going? Good. What have we got so far? Uh, uh, we did get a new ace back. Got the Frost last two. We got Unfair Stamps and the Frost last. Oh, we got the Creepy Frost Again, last. another card with the Soon moon in Arcanine. it. Great card. Every card that has a moon in it looks good. What uh, what David get in this one? He's uh, got grass fighting grass. Fighting. Not bad. Can I prove the moon theory right real quick? Can I can I pause the pause the group break for one second to look up a magic card? I can do that real quick. Hang on. Talking about Pokemon. That's fine. It's fine. You guys mentioned cards with moons that look cool. Yeah, Moonville region's a good one. That's fair. The moon theory is the correct theory. Thoughts? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, yeah it's a great card. Yeah, it's yeah. cool. Yeah, looks sick. If it's got a moon and it's gonna be a cool card. Yeah, yeah. that's how it works. <clears throat> yeah, that's right, Yakobi. Attach two leaf energy Little and attach them to your Pokemon only if you Lily. go outside and touch Okey grass. Okie dokie. If this has any dark energies attached to it, it gets 100 plus HP, and the deck it uses does 100 Jeez. more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. Excuse Jeez. me? This becomes a. What? 
Jesus. The one thing I will say is the dark energy obviously doesn't help pay for the attack cost, so it does add like a tax to the attack cost, but like that's that's kind of nuts. nuts. This becomes a base 230, not EX1 prizer. That does 170 damage for, for what's effectively three energy. That's nuts. That's like insane. Yeah, that's crazy. That's that's actually that's that seems like potentially pretty good. Sorry, I'm taking time to read cards here. I have not read all the cards yet. I've looked at all the arts and stuff, but I've not like properly okay. processed. Okay. Me and Steve. Me and Steve did our. Okay. So you think you're good? Benefit. Pezendipity. This is the dark energy attached to it, and is damaged by an attack. If the coins of heads prevent the damage, also seems solid. Fifty fifty seems chance good. to prevent the damage. No, well the. Number one, e EXs can one-shot them. Base Pokemon do see play. And the thing with that one is it doesn't get one-shot because it has 230 health and yeah, also yeah, is yeah. only one prize card. So, like, th this card's potentially good because it wouldn't get one-shot. It would have 230 health, and it's also only a one-prizer. So, I don't know. I, I think just discounting them because they're not EXs is wrong because... Prize card? That's a thing? That's how Pokemon works. Oh. Okay. Each each player is so you you draw your hand and then you take the top six cards of your deck, put them in the special prize card zone. Whenever you knock out your opponent's Pokemon, you take a prize card. If it's an EX, you take two. First player to collect all the prize cards wins. Oh, okay. So that's how okay, that's how that works. Oh baby. Let's go. Our second Ursula Luna. Blood Moon Ursula Luna full art number two. Also going to our man Big Truck. Happy I can pull truck. this one for you. This is a card I'll be definitely picking up for my PC, specifically this one. I love the red background with it. Looks really, oh, I really thought good. you were looking for the other one. I'm with looking all for the both. Teddy Ursus and all that stuff. The, uh, that one, legs. the Japanese one's cheaper, so I'm just going to probably buy that. It's like 30 bucks Japanese. Right. Um, this one I'll be picking up for PC as well. Uh, just a really, really nice looking card. Also a good card for the game. Um, I like cards in Pokemon because Pokemon, it's really hard to like come back in games a lot of the time. Yeah. And this is a card that helps you come back. Because uh, it reduces the cost to attack by colorless less for each prize card your opponent's taken. So if your opponent's taken three prize cards, the sack only costs two. It does 200 points. That's this is really, really good. That's, really, really that's good. nuts. It really is. Really, really is very good. We have a Diplin. Probo Pass and Walking Wake. Are you going to build a deck around the Ursaluna? <sighs> Maybe. I don't know. I, I actually do want to build the Dragapult deck because it looks really cool. I'd have to see what the what the, the good players are doing with their deck. What the good players Kuchiana, are doing? Kuchiana, Darumaka, and Walking Wake. I'm not experienced enough to... Uh, I'm not experienced enough in Pokemon to like build my own decks. That's fair. I'm not, I'm not, I can't, I can't brew in Pokemon, really. Um, it's okay, I can't really brew in Magic. I can kind of brew. Oh, I'm a, I'm a brewer through and through in Magic, I, yeah. That's my whole thing. I, I never steal decks. And for, especially... What is happening here? Okay, that's good. And especially in Commander, like, I can brew a decent amount, but I just, like, like getting help. We'll beat Poliwhirl, and we have Zapdos as our rare. I brew, yeah. I'm a, I'm a brewer in magic through and through. I like brewing budget decks in commander. It's always fun. Budget commander is always a good time. Lucian Monferno, and we have Heath Hearth Flame Master. That's our first Ogre one of that. Decks. First one of the Fire Ogre Pond. What's this one do? This attack is 20 damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. So if you have like four damage counters and 80, eh, eh, it's not very good. If your opponent's active Pokemon is evolution. Pokemon this attack does 140 more damage and discard all energy attached from. So 280, but it's like a supernova. I'm not so sure about that card. Looks cool. Strength, not a ton of strength, playability. Strength wise, I'm not I'm not really feeling that one. I think the grass one has a lot of potential, but that one that one seems uh seems not the best. Phantom is like an underrated Pokemon. I feel like I, I love, never I uh, love Phantom and Trump. Never give Phantom like the, the respect it deserves. I love Phantom. It's a great Leafeon art. Great Leafeon art. Conkledur, and we have Screamtail EX. Grass Screamtail was in here. Scream is a cool attack. You can use this attack only if you go second, only during your first turn. Your opponent can't play any supporter cards from your hand during the next turn. So that's actually really interesting. Um, I guess it's kind of like Yu-Gi-Oh! where it's better to go second. 
No, it's way better to go first. Okay. Um, going first, you can't attack and you can't play a supporter. So going second, you can attack it and play a supporter. Um, with this, because you can do both of those, it basically locks your opponent out of playing a supporter for their second turn, too. That's pretty huge. Um, I could see this card showing up. I think there are some psychic decks that, like, do see play. Um, interesting. I could see that card seeing play. Very, like, niche, but I could, I could see that. Locking, locking your opponent out of a supporter on turn two seems pretty solid. Whirlipede, Nose Pass, and Frostlass. Regular Frostlass there. Patsy Nagiri. Festival Crown. Each Pokemon has an energy attached. Refurbish them all special conditions versus Sting and Corphish. And we have Hassel! Nice! Nice. Use this card only if any of your Pokemon were knocked out during your first turn. Look at the top eight cards of your deck, put up to three of them into your hand. Interesting. I can see that same play. I can see that card being solid. Little little situational. Um, but I mean you get a dig through time, right? Yeah. It's a card I want. Dig through time that gets you an extra card. One dig thing you learn time. about uh, Pokemon Josh is drawing cards in this game is insane. Um Draw like nothing engines. like magic. Draw engines. Draw engines in this game are bananas. Chiyu and Infernip. Um, yeah, draw engines and Pokemon are just like a, you're you're living in a different reality. I love draw it's, engines. It's just, I love draw engines. You, you might as well be playing a different game. I love draw engines. They're the best. Lana's aid. We have Milotic and Okie Dokie. It is a draw engine game, yeah. It really is. <clears throat> One thing I like about Pokemon, I used to hate the Pokemon card game. I thought it was like too simple and stuff. Um, I didn't like that there's not really like a lot of interaction you can have with your opponent other than just attacking what they have out there. It's basically two people playing solitaire against each other. Um, but Pokemon really rewards you like knowing all the cards in your deck, knowing your outs to things, knowing what you're looking for. Um, and, like, basically setting up your board uh, in, in a really strategic way. And I like that it's, it feels like competitive puzzle solving. Okay. So it's, it's that kind of made me appreciate the game like, way more than I did. And the draw engines in the game are absolutely bananas. That's a Geary. This is crazy. What? Once during your turn, if this Pokemon's in the active spot, you may look at the top six cards of your deck, reveal a supporter card you find there, and put it back in your... Sure. That's really good. Um, this is one of those base Pokemon that will just see play. Probably, because that ability is really good. Uh, just finding, trying to find a supporter in the top six. And there's a lot of ways to, like, pre-retreat. You can use Switch, um, stuff like that. So I that card seems pretty good. Girder and Iron Leaves. It's such a distinct change for magic. Like, it doesn't function like magic at all. Um, Grookey. Litwick and Iron Leaves again. Like, you can take Tenants of Magic to learn how to play Pokemon, where it's like, you know, card and card advantage, all that stuff. Um, but it really is just about, like, setting up a good board state, and, uh, you know, the game really rewards you for, for efficiently and properly setting up a, a proper board state. Yu-Gi-Oh is kind of like that. Yu-Gi-Oh is a little bit like that, but it's... it's The thing with Yu-Gi-Oh, just with how all of the different types of summonings Mighty and all that stuff... Tinglu and Inferno. It's Yu-Gi-Oh's kind of gotten too far. Yeah. Yeah, player, you can't build it like a magic deck. That's right. No, that's right. It's just it's just a completely different game. Um, we have Poultry Geist. Prevent all damage. Effects of attack from taking some Pokemon. Interesting. So you can just put this for free on your bench. Okay, that's cool. Oh, the pincer. Nice. Let's go. Huge. Let's go. That's awesome. That's grass. That's just that's actually going to David, right? I love that. Yes. Nice. Nice hit for you, David. I love that pincer art. I also love this pincer. That's like the only pincer art you'll see where he's happy, where he's smiling. Yeah, he is happy. He's a happy boy. I do I do like that. He's very cute. I like that a lot. I Frost love Lass. that. I was unfortunately Wake did a uh, play collect shred with me yesterday, and that was my shred card. 
Pincher? Yeah, because he put really? it up. He put it up against the Infernape, which I said I would play, and then the EV, which I said I would collect. And uh, the Pincer was my second choice for play and collect, but it just I couldn't have it beat either one. It was unfortunate. Tough. Yeah, that was tough. Tough Very for Pincer. Tough I do like pincer. that Pincer a lot. Love Ball reverse. Love we have Laron. It's cool Laron art. And we have the Dragapult. There nice. It is. There he is. This is Pound for Pound, the best is. card in the set, most powerful card in the set, I think. Most powerful Pokemon in the set, I should say. Um, this card's just really good. Card is just really, really, really good. Um, and it's, I'm, you know, again, don't know a lot about the, the Pokemon meta, um, but I'm, I'm quite confident that this will see play. Um, yeah, 200 damage for one fire, one psychic. Well, it's not even just about and that. Damage, it's, yeah. It damages the bench, which is huge. You can turn to this with a rare candy. If you turn to this on the play, you're just going to win the game. Your opponent's not. Yeah, uh, six counters on their bench Pokemon. In any way nuts. you like, you can split it up. Yeah. Like, you can do four on that one, two on that one. No, this card's, like, actually cracked. Because if you go Dreepy, Energy, Pass, and, you know, like, it doesn't get knocked out, you can do this on your bench to, like, help protect it a little bit. Um. Yeah, a lot of decks will have a Mana Fee, but that's still fine. I mean, you're still doing 200 for two Energy. Is Mana Fee, like, a counter, basically? Um, Manaphy is, uh, the Manaphy Yakobi's talking about is, uh, and who knows, they might not have the Manaphy turn one. I mean, Battle VIP just rotated, right? So, yeah. um, it's this Manaphy, uh, prevent all damage under your bench Pokemon by attacks from your opponent's Pokemon. Okay. So, like, that is a clean counter, but, um, uh, you know, that most decks only run one. It's not like they're guaranteed to have it. And if they do, then so be it. <laughs> then you can bosses orders it to the active zone, kill it, and then they're and then they're cooked. Yeah, that's, that's fair. We have Illumize, Froki. Love bosses orders. That's orders. such a good Froki. I love that Froki. And Sinistra. I love the I love like when they do the claymation stuff. The claymation cards always look so good. They do. You get the evolution of energy by turn three, but that's the thing with rare candy, you can just do it on turn two. Because, like, the other day, I was looking through some of my old cards, and I found a first edition, um, uh, Shuckle. With the claymation. Oh, yeah. The Shuckle claymation. Does Rare Candy actually say you can't attack, though? That's, that's a Rare Candy Psychic. Oh, that's funny. No, okay, you can still attack. Sick. Yeah. Rare Candy, which is still in rotation. You... I'm going to search that over there. I don't know why that happened. That's fine. You might. I saw. I saw something online. More Pico, Revavroom, and Chandelure. I saw something online that said like the middle evolution actually just has like a free, like filtering, built in. Like its ability is just like look at the top few cards of your deck, put one in your hand once per turn. Um, so it's just sleight of hand for free. Dreepy. Or no, the first one maybe. Yeah, no, it's the middle stage. I'll point out the middle stage if we get one. Yeah, Charizard doesn't play Charmeleon. Sometimes you play, like, one just in case, but it's Dracolurk, I think. Stuff. Yeah. Belly Bolt, Reverse, Floet, and Sinistra. I'd love to see the uh, Sinistra. Dracolock. Dracolock. Okay. Speaking of Dracolock, I'll point it out. It says Dreepy again. Kilowatt oh, Roll, Sunkern, Reverse, Glimmet. Oh, we got the base Blood Moon or Saluna. There you go. Nice. Cool art. Nice Blood Moon there. Blood Moon or Selena. I'm so happy they came back with the EX cards. I love the EX I, cards. I like the EXs. So. I like the EXs a lot more than I like the Vs. I like the Vs, but... What do we EXs. have here? We have Timber. Nice. I like That's the, cool. I like that there's been a theme in the recent sets to just have, like, the Pokemon helping to build something. Yeah. I just I find that funny. Timber. Nice Timber. And Ting Lu. It's a fun Timber card. Here's our last pack of box number one. You want a split box too? Sure. Feel spare? All right. We have Phantom, Torkoal, and Walking Wake as our rare. To close out box one. Some nice stuff from box one. You can have the first half too. You have the first half of that box. All right. Well, well Josh and I are going to split box too. Thanks again, Truck and David, for selling this one out.
Awesome stuff. Much appreciated. Oh, yeah. It's always fun ripping some new, some new stuff. Like I said, I haven't been, I haven't been really collecting any of the new stuff since Scarlet and Violet base came out. I haven't really opened too much Pokemon, so. I just try to pick up some of the cheap illustration rares that I like. Heliolisk, Vulpix, Reverse, and Okie Dogie. What if, was it just one A spec out of that box? I think so. Interesting. It averages about like one to two. I, I think it yeah, averages about 1.5. Yeah, just the unfair stamp. Feels like 1.5 for box. Belly Bolt, Trevenant, Frogadier, and Iron Leaves. Yeah, we've gotten five total out of three boxes, so that's kind of like it. Community Center, Timber, and we have Screentail EX base. ACX Screentail. Solid card. Talked about that one already. That's something here. Diplin, Scolopine, Monferno, and we have Macargo EX. There you go. This is what he told me to read. Yeah. So Burns, 270. It's a lot of HP. Burns your opponent's Pokemon for 70. Discard the top card of each player's deck. Thanks. Hmm. Yeah, so you can do 420 damage if you get if you good luck. high roll. That's if you get mm. good luck. So here's the problem: how many energies do you think decks run? It's what a 65 card deck. 60 card deck. 60 card deck. I'd say probably like what, five or six. It's like 10. 10. 10. We'll see. We'll see we'll we see got see another full art blood moon. Ursula. Oh really? Yeah. Damn. The same one you got in round one. Okay. One A spec out of box one. Timber. Oh, the timber's cool. The timber is cool. Timber's cool. Who got timber? Was that the Abel? Bebe and Tingloot. Uh, oh, we got a Dragapult. Just pull it up. Just like minimize it and pull it up. We did get the Dragapult. Oh, yeah. David did, did get the uh, nice. timber. Yeah, that's cool. Dragapult. Oh, we got the pincer. Yeah, yeah David we got the pincer. David has the pincer, too. David, David, pincer David. Too. Have a break. A little two spot magic form. Another one for Big Truck. Nice one there. And then the peed. Probo Pass. We got him. Let's go. Oh, we got We got the Probo. Pass. Going to David. Yeah, David's this. having a break. Going to David. David's having a Pokemon nice little break. We got the Thanks. Probo. It's like 80. It's a land crush. Cool. That's cool. We got the Probo. That's such a cool Probo Pass. I love the low tad there. I love them all. The thing with making in. your deck all energy is it only guarantees that it does 280. Uh, What's up, Max? Which is fine, but. And it's still pretty good, actually. But. Alucha. Moon. Looks cool. Yeah, another moon card. And Teal Mask Ogre Pond. <clears throat> I love how I just make them look like. Oh, there's a Larvitar in the background, too. Boomerang Energy, Poliwhirl, and we have Lucian, Full Art Trainer. Nice. Each player shuffles their hand and puts it on the bottom of their deck. If either player puts any cards on the bottom of their deck this way, each player flips a coin. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting card there. Interesting trainer. Probably uh, probably not going to see play, but it, it's interesting. We have Whirlipede, Ninetales, and Hisuian Arcanine. <clears throat> Kilowattro, Helioptile, Kadabra. And Frostlock, Kadabra. What's happening? I don't know. Okay. I don't know. I'm ignoring it. Ignoring it. Diplin, Litwick, and we have Sinistra EX. Sinistra EX, put two damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon for each basic route to energy and enter your discard pile. Shuffle those energy cards into your deck. Interesting. Interesting, interesting build around card there. Take grass energy into your deck. With an attack without doing damage to you can target the bench. That's really, really good. That's really good. So, fun little, um, fun little, uh, Intricacy of Pokemon, right? So we remember that Manaphy we just talked about? Sure. Um, yeah. So it says, prevent all damage done to your bench Pokemon by attacks. This gets around Manaphy. Because it's not dealing damage, it's putting damage counters on. 
So would Manaphy, that, Manaphy does nothing to stop this. That would also work for Dragapult, because you're putting them on. Oh, you're so right. Yeah, no. Yeah, you're uh, putting Manaf- them on. Manaphy, you're not Manaphy, does, Manaphy does not stop Dragapult. You're just Kobe. putting yeah. the counters on. Manaphy does not stop Dragapult. Yeah. That's a great call. That's a great call. But yeah, that is how that works. Dealing damage is not the same as uh, putting damage counters on. Fun. Fun little interaction there. So yeah, Manaphy doesn't even stop that. So that's cool. <laughs> All right. Still haven't seen the middle stage of Dragapult. Yeah, we know Dracolock. Phoebus and Zapdos. Nobody cares about Dracolock, apparently. Apparently. It doesn't exist. I love Phoebus. It's a little derpy fish. The other thing we'd have to do is look at all the Dreepies in Standard to see which ones are the best one. We got our Ace spec here. Our Ace spec is Secret Box. There you go. Good thing he Check didn't pull those. the secret string to reveal the secret compartment of our Secret Box. You got to do the goblin there, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you discard three other cards from your hand. Search your deck for setup, an right? item, tool, supporter, and stadium. Good setup Put card. them into your hand. It's Interesting. Interesting. It's that good, is a good setup card. It's a good setup card. <clears throat> so again, the thing with A-Specs, you can only have one in your deck total. Yep. Not just like one of this, one of any of them. Um, oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, no. Um... Hi, Jay-Z. I could see a specific deck running running this. I could see like a specific kind of deck choosing that as their ace spec. That would that would make sense to me. I don't think it'll be like a widely played one, but there could be decks that want that. <clears throat> I love this far fetch dart dearly. Some Pokemon that gets a lot of hate for no reason. It's a great Pokemon. I love far fetch. It's not a good Pokemon to use though. No, I have not. used it several times. It's, it's not, not good. Surfetch is good, though. Look at the top card of your deck. You may discard that card. Interesting. Surfetch Brokey isn't bad. And Okie Doki. Surfetch. Nice. All right. We're about approaching the end of the first half of box two. We do have group break number three coming up right after this. <clears throat> we're supposed to start at 145. That's not going to happen. Sorry. I've been talking too much. Illumize, Varum, and Walking Wake. Okay. Well... Looking at new new stuff that's supposed to come out tomorrow together. Yes. Let's see. There's an EV. Even the base EV art in this is really good. Yeah. Glimet and Infernape. I do think this Infernape's good. Yeah. <clears throat> Sets up the attack instantly. Um. And also, like, you don't even need to attach to Infernape. It lets you, like, set up your, your board in any way you'd like. So that's kind of cool. I don't know. I can see it. Imolga. Oh, we got the Sunflora. Let's go. Nice. Sunflora illustration rare. That one's going to Big Truck. No, that one's going to David. Sorry. That one's going to David. David's having a break. All of the illustration rares have been like, have been grass and fighting. It's a great break for David. Another Sunflora. David's kind of cleaned up right now. We got the Sunflora. Yes, sir. We sure did. Getting all this sick All for David. Guys. All of them have been for David. David's having, David's, really David's, having break, David's having a good second break. Truck still. David's having a really good break. Truck still getting stuff. Well, he's got seven spots. Oh well, yeah, he'll get stuff. He's true. giving the A specs. A specs. Yeah. He got the Ursa Luna. But, yeah, the sub oh. the sub floor is awesome. Drac look. There you uh, go, so once during your turn, you may look at the top two cards of your deck, put one of them in your hand, put the other card in the bottom of your deck. So it's a free sleight of hand. There's a magic card called sleight of hand that literally really has this text. Sleight of hand has has this text literally after the first yeah, part. Yeah, no, literally. That's um, a really good ability. So that's so I think people will probably play a copy of the middle stage, um, instead of rare candies. I, you will play rare candies, but I think like Jacoby was saying, like the Charizard decks don't play Charmeleon, which is fine. They don't have to. Oh yeah, no, the, mo- most people play rare candies. But I I, th- I think you might want to sneak a Dracloak into your deck because that ability is yeah. really really good. Especially too if um, you don't draw a rare candy. You're yeah, screwed. like you want to at least have some way you can set it up. Max, it looks, it look, oh Max, looks better in person. I played than Max. Better. I played so much Plants vs Zombies when I was younger. I loved Plants vs Zombies. I love Plants vs Zombies. That's a really cool art. I like this. We got the Sun Kern. We got the Darmanitan and the Frostlass like to close us out. Josh is going to take over for the back half of box two. Okay, where are you going? Oh, no, 
you to sit here? Yeah, I can. Yeah, cool. So, probably will. No, yeah, you're good. Like um, I'm just going to help out with the third break, if you guys don't mind. That's yeah, fine. that's fine. Because I know Molio's got a few spots. Yeah. Um, so I'll help. I'll do one of the boxes for the third break. I'm, uh, I'm going to get the invoice for all this first. So okay. I'll be in a little bit. Sounds good. All right, guys. Abra there. There's this cool snow run, Chimico. Dot, our Applin Reverse. Looks like we have our EX here. There's Fion and a Cornerstone Mask Ogre Pond EX there. Snorlax, sleepy boy. Palisand, I love Palisand. I love Palisand. Super, super glossed over with the Sinistu there on the uh, hollow. Oh, what's the fighting ogre pun do? Oh, that's right, you haven't looked at that one yet. No damage from attacks, damage from Pokemon here. Pokemon that have an ability. Interesting. We haven't that's got, actually, that seems really good. We haven't gotten a regular water one. We got the... Um, we got the... Terrestrialized one in the first box, but we haven't seen a regular water one. Okay. Move that up a little bit. Caretaker on the reverse. There's Palafin on the reverse and a Ting Lu there. That's cool, Goldine, with all the fireworks going on. That's cool. Creepy, Sandy. Terracross is our reverse. Swirlix. Walking Wake on Mahalo. Thoughts on Swirlix? Fine. Not one of my favorites. Steve said it'd probably be in, like, the 800s. Yeah, it's probably for me, too. I, there's not many Pokemon I truly hate, like, despise, and I wouldn't consider Swirlix one I despise. Not my favorite by any means. Yeah, it's fine. It's it's not a horrible design or anything. Kuchiana there on our first reverse with a sand shrew and a monkey dory. Good card. Talk about monkey dory. Good card. Let's get that EV here. Little boom on the reverse. We have Darumaka there, and we have Palafin EX there. I think that's the first time we've seen him. It is. Palafin so, EX. How's that one doing? So this is the card the the Palafin regular lets you switch with this. Put this yes. Pokemon into play with the effects of Palafin Journey directly. Okay, so its ability is just to do that. It just says Giga. So two fifty for one blue. Jesus. And then during your next turn, it can't attack. That's okay. It's not bad. It'd be good. I love this Chansey. He's just sitting in the field. He's just sitting in the field. Monkey Dory there. And we have a Hisuian Arcanine. Okay, reverse Dory. Yep. Reverse rare there. Nice. Yep. I don't really like the base rares. Hollows. I don't like the hollow treatment on them. That's fair. I much prefer the reverses. Leafeon reverse there. Cordfish and Pheasant Dippy. Anyone else feel that? I don't, I just, I don't know. I don't, I don't like the border on the hollows. I don't, I don't know. I hate that they switch to the silver border on the cards. I don't I, mind I don't that. Like it. That's fine. I, I don't like it. I don't like how the hollow they have on them. Though. That's fair. Mariana reverse. Infernape Reverse Rare there. And oh, Infernape Regular Rare. Very nice. Cool. Funny. Oh, man. You know what would be great? Reverse Infernape, Illustration Infernape, Rare Infernape. Because I think that's technically possible. Yeah. Because you still get I one. So. Yeah, I think that I think that's still possible. It's cool. Polyrath. It's cool. Girder there, Alakazam on the rare. Use the 
Skirter. Tangeli will reverse. Echo. Something there. Tatsugiri. There's a Skarmory on the reverse. Tatsugiri is also reverse. Looks like we have Ogre our pond. next EX. Yep. Teal Mask Ogre Pond there. We have our next A spec. Nice. So we did get two from this. Yes. There's Amber Palm. Didn't like Amber Palm. I'm not a big I like Apom. I like a Palm. I like Apom a lot. Don't like Amber Yeah, Amber Palm a little too much. Looks weird. Hyper Aroma. Was that the Yep, that's that's a dupe from the first. Yeah. Three up to three stage one Pokemon. There's not bad. Behind it. Oh, oh let's go. Sick. The Torkoal. Juice pack. The Torkoal. With an Okie Dogie there in the back. We got the Torkoal Illustration Rare. Just hanging out with his with his trainer there, making some making some clay pots. That is a great Torkoal. Torkoal underrated Pokemon. I love Torkoal. Thank you, yes, thank you everybody for yes, selling the breaks out. Sure. Much appreciated. We were sweating yesterday a little bit. Truck to the side. Everyone else goats. Every yeah. Third group break is third not group break. At all. No, yeah. yeah. Everybody else bought into that third one, which is huge. Pulled you guys there on the reverse. What Something do we weird. have here? That's gonna be this. Uh, sea King. The There's the Snishu. Nice. Yes, very nice. That looks sick. Another nice hit for David, man. Great. That's sick. Awesome card. Love the background on that. Yeah, the purple Gorgeous swirl. Purple. The purple swirl, yeah. That, that'll be a PC card for me, too. Yeah, that's cool. That's going to be a card I pick up for sure. Welcome back, Munoz. The Fable. There's Brute Bonnet on the reverse. With a layer on there and a Chandelure. What love do you mean Chandelure. it looks ridiculous? What's wrong with it? Love it's Chandelure. Great. I love Sinistra. The, uh... Did you see the trailer they made for Sinistra? Mm -hmm. They revealed it. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Froki, Phantom, Rigorath. There's Dreepy on the reverse. Dreepy. Torkoal on the reverse. It's cool. And a regular Teal Mask Ogre uh, Pond there. Trucking and David buy all the other. Trucking and David bought the first two. Uh, Munoz, you are in the third one. In the third the with a bunch of people. Yes. Yeah, there's like. I think I, I think David bought into all of David, the breaks. David P is in all of them. Yeah, David P is in all three. Yeah, he Shout was, out David P. He was the new guy that came in on Monday. Ah, okay. When okay. we were selling out all those breaks. Shout out David P. Um, bought and, in all three. And then, yep. yeah, it's, it's Munoz. It's you, David, Jacoby. Phantom um, Reverse, Floet on the reverse, and a Zapdos Hollow. And I don't know who the other ones are. Two packs left here in our second box here for our second group break. We're going to be hopping right into the third one. Basically immediately. Glalie, Ogre's Mask there. There's Belly. Reverse Belly. Oh, it's Doctor. Aaron. Thank you, Doctor. I'm sorry. And Enamorous as the rare. I hate Enamorous. I hate I, they... Yeah, Enamorous is going to be really, really, really well for me. I hate that they didn't need to add another one. Nope. I don't there even like... No... Honestly, all four of them are going to be really low for me. I hate them all. Um, Landorus is the only one that I like. Nope. Like is a very strong word there for me. I don't like any of them. I'm not the biggest fan of any of them. I don't like any of them. This is still break two. We're on the last Glaceon. pack of break two. Perrin there on the reverse. We ending have a Glaceon. Are we ending with an EX? We are. Blood, nice. Moon, Earth, Saluna, regular Let's EX. Big They're dubs. very nice. Big dubs. All right, guys, that is it for our second group break there. All right, so we got three A specs. We got how many illustration rares? Four. How do we couple the double over? Uh, four A specs. Three A specs, right? Four. Is it four? Three. 
Oh yeah, that's number three, right? Three A specs, five illustration rares, two of the EX full arts, one of the Blood Moon Ursulina, one of the Sinistra. I don't know why uh, the top loads did that first. One full art trainer. Oh, sorry, six something. illustration rares. Yep. Six illustration rares. So good stuff all around. Yep, that was break two, and we are about to do break three after we upload this next one. Thank you guys all for buying into this, uh, David and Mr. Big Truck. Just finished.